Yeah, this film has a bit of a disturbing vibe to it, but I do like psychological stuff, especially psychological thrillers. Perhaps this is, I don't know exactly where this will go between thriller and horror, we'll see, but this is called Caveat. Apparently, if I understand this right, this is a Shudder release, and Shudder, I believe, is a, I'm not too familiar with them. I think I've looked at some of the content from them in the past, very rarely, but I believe they're like a horror streaming type platform because everybody's got a streaming service these days and apparently you've got one exclusively for i think it's for horror films uh namely maybe you have thrillers that kind of seep in but i would i believe it's mostly for horror films i'm not a big horror guy personally i mean i do like some of the films i've seen but again i'm very careful of a lot of the films that i watch because again i'm not a big gore person and being a christian i'm sensitive to, like the supernatural content i don't find that entertaining i kind of don't like the mainstay but that's taken over the past couple years but i am in for a good story foreboding aesthetics and a lot of jump scares so <laughs> i don't know if that's the way this will go i'm sure i, I i'm assuming this has it just, i, I kind of got this vibe of the poster but this is going to have more of like an indie awards film type look to it we'll see but this is called caveat we're gonna look at i think two trailers for it not in the same video or i'm gonna make them separately or separate uh, watches but we're gonna take a look at the first trailer in a second but this is what it says according to imdb for what you can expect plot wise a lone drifter suffering from partial memory loss accepts the job to look after a psychologically troubled woman in an abandoned house on an isolated island. So already you're dealing with like a secluded setting of, oh, we're, you know, we're, I, I guess, in, uh, in, encircled by bodies of water, not much of an escape, and you have to help this, as they say, a psychologically troubled woman. Where is this going to go? I, again, like I said, it seems a bit disturbing. We'll see. We're going to watch the trailer for this first, and we're going to talk about it more in my condensed review segment following us watching the video together okay without further ado let me take a look and see if i can find the right trailer okay let's take a look at caveat which apparently got an official selection at scream fest 2020 according to the video i'm looking at here we go so they got an awards run i told you looked like an awards movie official selection at the horror film festival okay Yeah, that's a bit disturbing. <laughs> Scratching noises, yeah. Carving. So what's the story behind that rabbit? Because that's what's on the poster, too. A lot of circles here. I love how the tea just like, drips down. That plays like an awards horror trailer. <laughs> it does. I mean, again, it seems very small and focused, but it has that grounded feel to it. I, I'm interested to learn the story of the rabbit, because that was a bit disturbing, like the drumming noise and the scratching. Yeah, that was... It, it, it makes you tense. Uh, it was a much. We're gonna watch another uh, trailer, a different video. It's a bit longer, so we're probably gonna get a better look at the film in terms of a narrative standpoint. But yeah, it's pretty creepy. Um, you got some guy in uh, what what they say? The, I guess I'm assuming that character that we see in the chains is the lone drifter. I'm assuming. Um, da -da 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 -da. So he's, I didn't notice that at first. This is kind of interesting to me. He's suffering from partial memory loss. And he's looking after a psychologically troubled woman. It's like, if they're both not operating in a position of, you know, wholesome sanity, <laughs> it's like, yeah, oh, there's an expression on that. But it, how much help can you really get in that type of situation? You know what I mean? If like you're psycholo psychologically troubled and the person that you're dealing with already has, you know, psychological trouble that they're dealing with on their own, it just seems like a mixed bag for disaster. You know what I mean? It's kind of like, I don't see much success coming out of a situation, but hey, it's it looks intriguing. Um, it seems like he's trying to escape, maybe? Maybe he recognizes, like, that's probably an aspect I'm sure to the film, that the, the memories are going to start trying to come back to the surface. 
I don't know if that's actually what's going to play out, but hey, I mean, it looks intriguing. The, it, the scratching noise makes it tense. Maybe he, maybe that's him trying to escape. It looks like the woman, maybe she's, maybe it's a psychological trouble woman and she's trying to follow him. Not sure, but it'll be an interesting watch. I will give a second trailer a look, uh, but what are your guys' thoughts on Caveat? Let me know down below. For those of you who may have gotten to see it, you know, I'm sure it, it's, it's awards run. Is it a film worth, you know, worth checking out? Let me know down below. Don't forget all that stuff. I like it, subscribe, and the sharing thing that bell. Until we get to watch more from Caveat, specifically that second trailer, I will see you guys what more than that is to be. But for now, thanks for watching this video. I love you guys. Don't forget to subscribe to your fellow man. God bless and peace.